Hi, it's Dave, K7JI here with a video update on my Alpha 77 SX amplifier. This is a gorgeous amp that I just had refurbished and upgraded by Dick Bird in Atlanta, N4UQ. Dick went through this thing for me and uh, really got her going. And I did uh, previously did a video showing that um, how much I love the amplifier, how beautifully it was packaged, the great work that Dick did on it, restoring it, etc. So now about a week ago, Dick uh, gave me uh, an email, sent an email, and said that he had a friend who was selling a new old stock transformer that I might be interested in as an upgrade for this amplifier. So here's what the transformer is. Uh, this is the original Peter Dahl uh, spec sheet on this transformer. And you can see the secondary, the high voltage secondary, 3400 volts at 0.9 amps, continuous commercial service. Now, this is quite an upgrade in a higher uh, voltage transformer than the transformer that came in the amplifier when I got it from Dick and the stock transformer that is supplied or was supplied when the amp was new. And this particular uh, transformer is new old stock from when the Peter Dahl company was in El Paso, Texas. This is one of the last um, El Paso, Texas uh, 77SX uh, Peter Dahl transformer upgrades that they sold and the model number on this transformer is the A77S4. Now, the Peter Dow Company exists uh, to this day, but with a different owner, and um, I'm not familiar with the new transformers. I've been in touch with them the last couple of weeks, and I don't have a price quote on what the new transformer is, and I have no personal knowledge of how it works, but I can say that this old transformer new old stock is amazing. So here we go, let's start with the high voltage. In the resting mode, the high voltage here um, compared to the 2500 volts with the old uh, stock transformer, the resting high voltage is now a little more than 3300 volts. And in the high voltage position, in the high power position here, now the resting voltage is 4,800 volts. That's going to drop about 1,000 volts under load. So anyway, let's scope it out. Now the last time we did this test, we um, were driving the amplifier into the Palstar dummy load with about 130 watts, I believe, for about 4 kilowatts out. Now this time with the new transformer installed, we have, oh, 124, 125 watts drive, so a little less than before. And let's see what that'll do for output into the dummy load now with the new transformer. There we go. So about 1,000 watts more output into the dummy load. And of course, at legal limit, this amplifier is just in a coma. This amplifier is so happy and easy to use now, and uh, a plus with this new transformer is that the grid, let's go to the grid setting over here on the multimeter, you'll notice that the grid is, is very, very low for, <laughs> for 5 kilowatts out into the dummy load. We only see about, oh, 150 mils of grid, that's split between two tubes, and uh, you'll notice that the ALC light doesn't even begin to come on. No problem at all. While we're doing it, let's just see what the um, ammeter reads on this. Okay, so not quite uh, 1.6 amps um, because this meter is uh, doubled in value because of the two tubes. So anyway, you can see this amplifier is just screaming. It's so happy with this new transformer. The grid's way down. It's super easy to tune. It's very forgiving. Thanks to Dick Bird, N4UQ, and his friend Barry for turning me on to the upgrade here and really helping me enjoy this amplifier and getting it to the next level. Well, you guys did a great job. I appreciate it so much. Thanks, you guys. If you want to be in touch with Dick for Alpha Amplifier Upgrades, his website is n4uq.com.